Hey there, fellow gamers. My name is Zach, and I just want to make a big announcement that Five Nights at Freddy's 4 is officially confirmed by Scott Cawthon himself. If you guys head on over to scottgames.com right now, you'll be able to see this nightmarish looking Freddy. And one thing I want to point out is that he looks kind of like Springtrap. He kind of has like the same body tone, like the same design, except for the head, which is, of course, Freddy. Because, as we all know, in the Five Nights at Freddy's 3 minigame, the Stage 1, where you, like, play as Golden Freddy, as we think, or, like, Shadow Bonnie near the end, is that there's Springtrap and there's this Freddy. We all think it's Golden Freddy, but now I'm not too fully sure. So, could this Freddy be that other animatronic that was mentioned in that minigame? One significant difference as well between this Freddy and Springtrap is that his fingers look kind of like drills. Now I'm not fully sure why that is. I don't know if it's going to be like the new way for him to kill us in the new game. It could just be like the tips of the fingers ripped off and there was just for some reason drill like drill like fingers in there. I hope that he explains it in the fourth one which I'm sure he will. There's one other thing i like to point out with this animatronic too, is that there's five fingers instead of four. So that means he must have the same model as Springtrap did, where a human can go inside it and act like an animatronic in a way. But we all know that purple guy was Springtrap. Now this leads into a new question of who could possibly be inside this suit. We all know it can cannot be uh, purple guy, because he was already Springtrap. So the only candidates that are possible are the original diner owner, <clears throat> although I'm not sure how that is fully possible. Another candidate could be the phone guy himself, Mike Schmidt. We just don't know. It could be a new guy altogether, but I have a giant feeling that it's just one of the previous other characters that were mentioned in earlier games. So let me guys know as well who you guys think it is in the comments below. Now another big difference too is that embedded within them are a bunch of smaller looking freddies that have razor sharp teeth and they definitely have the same hat as in the last teaser trailer that scott cawthon provided us so i have no idea what this means i don't know if he's like a collection of animatronics like we think springtrap is so let me guys know what you think in the comments below on wh what you think that means and one final thing I want to show you guys is that I just I edited the image to look kind of spring trap-ish so it'll be easier to read the letters that are kind of hidden in the background at the bottom but if you look closely you guys can see that it reads nightmare and I don't know if this is just like a little joke because he's supposedly releasing it on Halloween I don't, like I don't know if that's just a joke I don't know if it's because it's the final one that it's gonna be the most terrifying one of them all but there's a bunch of questions that this picture provides, but one thing is for certain is that Five Nights at Freddy's 4 is officially confirmed. Now, we don't know if it's meant for Halloween like it says. Where I don't know if he might release it early like he has the, pa like the past couple games. But all in all, this is going to be the final one, guys. I I'm expecting amazing work from Scott. Keep up the great work, man. I hope that this game is going to be amazing for the final one. And just wanted to make that announcement for you guys and share a little bit of info regarding the picture. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Later, guys.